Fellas, best of luck with everything. Fargini. You ready? It's only you and I. So Pedro's got a cold, he's dying. Pedro, are you dying? I'm dying, man. Are you dying? I'm dying. What a fucking irresponsible prick getting sick right before a trip. Are we, are we named beneficiaries on a life insurance? Marcia, why are you carrying so many things? <laughs> I carry a lot of things. Okay, so uh, uh, it's raining now. Let's yes. go. Oh, it stopped raining just for now. How nice. Bargini, you and I are going to try something new today. Something new, Aren't we? Yeah. Yes. Should we tell them what kind of car? Yeah, because you guys haven't... Okay, so we've been getting a lot of shit because we haven't driven an Infinity yet. And I don't know anything about them, so we're going to go drive one. I, Ready, Fargini? I love Infinities. I've had two of them. I didn't know that. We'll talk about this. Okay, we're about to get into the freeway, but we just got our seats, our, well, our asses massaged by the seat. How bad is the seat massage it's, in it's this not, car? It's not good. It literally, it's like, it's... I feel like there's a hamster behind me going like... Oh, I feel like there's a hamster under... Never mind. Look up Richard Gere. You'll, you'll know what we're talking about. <laughs> Fargini. Beverly Hills Infinity. This used to be a BMW back in the day. Do you know that? I did not know this that. Is, I don't this, know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. This is where I bought my first BMW. <laughs> first or at least my first BMW here. First and last? First and uh, I got a... Do you think we're going to... Got like a few of them, but uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> let's let's go with that. Do you think the energy and, and flow of a BMW is going to be in that building? <sighs> let's hope not. I have no idea what to expect. Actually... I don't know anything about these cars, dude. So here's the thing. So Infinity um, kind of goes after BMW. So this makes it perfect. <laughs> they took over. So this is why you're bringing us here? <laughs> no, I, I like Infinities. I, I, uh, I'm a huge you did. You had Infinity. one, right? I had, two, I had two Infinities. And uh, they're great cars. They really are good cars. Uh, I'll be the judge you, yeah, of that. I'm curious to see what you think. I don't know what to expect. What? What? Okay. So what? What's? What should I expect? Um. A, a BMW-like feel and performance for less than a BMW. Sounds like a pretty good deal to me. This is the one that you were saying that it's like Ivan's car? So, they're just telling us this is like a one-to-one -one of Ivan's. This is a GLA. Like, the keys of Mercedes. Even the engine, right? Even the engine, it's like a one-to-one. -one. That's fucking crazy. Should, should, should we bring uh, Ivan? We need, to, we need to bring Ivan. Also, I think the, the, the really fucked up thing is, could have we saved Ivan some money? Oh, I, I, I swear to you, I had the same thought. I was like, listen, I Ivan doesn't gonna kill no, 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 but Ivan doesn't have to watch this. He's not like the one editing it or something. better. Wow. They should have this car outside, dude. There's no question about it. Yep. They should have kept this car outside. It's gotta hit the road, be on the streets. We gotta let people see this. The ones we've seen were pretty hot. Every one we've seen on the road, we've liked. Every single time, yeah. I, I like, I really like the lines on the car. From the side, it doesn't look that great, but from the front and from the back, oh. But how many cars can, can knock out a good front and back? Nah, not, not everyone. Yeah. I wish I could everyone. knock out a good front back. <laughs> I can't believe this dealership trusted us with this car. <laughs> What's the first thing Salomon Junku does when they get into any vehicle? Sport Plus, son. 
sport plus on the car. And then they said that right here, steering. Oh. We're gonna go with Sport Plus, Dynamic. I Whoa. feel like I'm in a BMW. Oh, Dynamic Plus. And then suspension. I think suspension I'm gonna leave standard. Okay. Right? Uh, okay. Active trace control. What's active trace control? We uh, want that, don't we? It feels like you'll die if you don't have I know, the trace. I know, we need that. It feels <laughs> essential to it. Before we start talking about the car, because that's ridiculous, you're gonna just get in the car and based on what they told you at the dealership, you'll talk about. We, we, you and I have a meeting with Brendan, our partner Correct. in Fuku. So let's yeah. go have a meeting. Let's probably go get something to eat, yeah. figure out the car, and then we'll do a video about the car. Let's do it. Are you ready? Let's do it. Bargini? Yes, sir. I think we've driven the Infiniti Q60 Red Sport. Is I that right? So. I believe so. It's red. I know there's a red in there. Yeah, I know red it's red, sport. but yeah, yeah, yeah. the red sport, <laughs> enough. Yes. I think we know what works, what doesn't work, <laughs> yes. and what exactly it is. I just want to give the people five things to understand this car better. Cupping vehicle virgins, Parker specifically, but not about hate. Yes. Because hate is so harmful, yes. Parker. Yes. <laughs> I'm kidding. I, I just don't have the balls and to And being do it. likable is easy for us. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to do five things that you should know about this car, yes. period. Yes. Number one, the design is fucking exquisite when you say Fargini. The front and the back, there's nothing that looks like it. On the, from the side, staring at it directly from the side yeah. is not my cup of tea, yeah. not the best angle for the car, but front, back, and three quarters anywhere. Oh. Power. Raw power of this car. This is something that surprised the shit out of me. This car has 400 horsepower. Right? Yep. It's a V6 twin turbo engine in it. Yep. Three liter. Three liter with 400 horsepower, guys. And I know that 400 horsepower normally doesn't sound like much now these and, days. And yeah, these days it's not that These big days it's not like, yeah. But this is fucked up. Yeah. This is really fast. What else did you like? What? Well, dude, the fucking how easy it is to use the car. Are you kidding me? What do you mean? This is one of the easiest cars I've ever gotten into. Like, there's nothing you have to learn. I, I was able to figure out every single menu, every yeah. single setting, every single thing within the car in seconds. What's the first thing you did you got in? Sport Plus Sport. Dynamic. Blah, blah, blah. I turned into a BMW driver <laughs> right away. Yeah, you're I right. Put, you I did. put it in the most dynamic, <laughs> craziest mode possible yeah. right off the bat. But yeah. it was so easy to find. Yeah. Can you blame and me for that? It's got these two huge screens. So, that's, But that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So everything is so easy because your navigation is on top. Your dash is right here. All of your controls are right here at the bottom. Touch screen. Touch screen. Which the Germans aren't doing. Not all of them. And I know yeah. Mercedes is not doing it yet. Yeah. But at least not in the cars in. that we have. Yeah. But it will because yeah. you have Apple Play. But this one has everything is touch screen and everything works. And what I like the most about it, all the setup, it's got buttons on top of it. Yes. So it's not like you got to figure everything out on the menus. You literally go like all the buttons are right here, home. Everything is just so well laid out. Yeah. I I know it sounds like, well, it should be like that, Alondra, but most cars are not. Like the ones we drive are not they're laid not out intuitive. like that. They're not intuitive like at all. Not at all. Let's talk about value, son. That's, I think that's an important thing when it comes to infinity. Like they might not want to be known as the value kind of kind of car, but 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 here's the thing: you're giving the most amount of uh, power for the price. And I think they told us this is one of the most powerful V6s. Oh, at the you price can buy for the for the for the price point. I think this is the cheapest way of getting 400 horsepower stuck from an engine yeah. out of the dealership. So the other thing about the, about the value with these, so there's three versions you can get of this. Okay. There's the two liter four cylinder. Yeah. Then there's the same V6 but 300 horsepower, and then there's the red version, which is 400 horsepower, which is this. And I asked, you know what I asked, you know what I asked the manager and the salesperson. Uh -huh. there? I was like, give me the real, give me some real lease prices, okay. like just real, like not mess dicking around. How much is this a month? Like this one, this one. This one, like around six hundred, six in the mid sixes, and it's a sixty. This car, sixty-three thousand uh, dollar sticker, and it's got carbon fiber. This that, a sixty-three thousand dollar car in the six hundreds. Ivan should really not watch this episode. <laughs> I know he's gonna. And then get this, uh, the same car uh -huh. with three hundred horsepower, which in itself is very respectable. That's in the five hundreds, and the two liter one is in the three hundreds. Oh, Three hundred dollars for, 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 for a car that looks like this. Yep, I agree. At the same thought, 
I'm sorry, guys. I'm blown away by this because I'm just learning about it. Learning, learning about it. This is, this is your, this is your way of this, yeah, yeah, yeah. this is my coaching of it. So this brings up to the last point that you actually brought this up. What does this car remind you of? Okay, so I'm going to get a lot of shit for this one, but okay. this is this is just what I think, Virginia. And you tell me if I'm right or wrong. Tell okay. me if I'm, I'm saying I'm right. <laughs> uh, oh, well, you're always right. Because thank I'm, you, I'm yes, thank you. Yes. I'm your yes man. Yes, of okay, course, yeah. of yes, course. Yes, you know how it is. You're right. I think... The best way to conceptualize this car, if that's a real word yes. that I just used, <laughs> yes. is to think about it like a, like if you were a GTR owner, this is a grown-up version of that GTR, like a more composed, easy. Also, you can't. It's not an upgrade from the GTR simply because the GTR is so expensive now. But the materials they're, are they're shitty over, everywhere. Over 100, over, yeah. I would say the interior of this is probably better than the GTR. It's better looking than the GTR. It yeah. doesn't have the crazy, crazy horsepower, the one that gives you the, oh, uh, while you're on the street. But this is more than enough. So yeah. the, the GTR is when you graduated high school. <laughs> yeah. You were smoking some stogies like back in the parking <laughs> yeah. lot and yeah. you were chilling, surfing through life. This is the car your dad told you, put your big boy pants on. Get into law school and yeah. get the fuck out there. And this is the car you're going to take with you. What are your favorite lines? To me, it's right here. Like that. That front is crazy good looking, dude. Look at this crease. Like, I don't think that, that I don't think that's easy. That's just the design do, element. Right? No, 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 no. Oh. This has all the radar and the... Oh, yeah. That's why they make it black like that with the little screen thing. Yeah. You know, it's crazy. You know something cool? All oh, like the carbon fiber, like real carbon fiber, look. Carbon oh yeah, it's here. got a lot of carbon fiber, so this car has a carbon fiber package, right? Uh, yep. Right there. You can't skip those. And then on the back you have the wing. Uh, that, this but look at this. Favorite element too. Right here. Such a nice ass, no? The exhaust look fucking epic. <laughs> What you were talking about, no? Yeah, yeah, those, I don't know, I know it's not a big deal, it just looks cool, no? No, it's a good, it's, yeah, it's a design element, dude, it doesn't matter. This is an Infinity. They have a lot of the cars here. I don't know what So this that's is their thing, right? Yeah, it's a, it's their thing. And obviously, we're doing this where? <laughs> hey, I've never seen this in a car. It's like a, look at how luxurious this material here is. La Tolva. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do we give this thumbs up? It's a thumbs up for sure. It's okay. Grand? Fuck yeah. So should we tell them uh, uh, if they go to the dealership if Fargini, say Fargini sent me, they'll give them a good deal, you think? A huge deal. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. <laughs>